Hello there, my name is Ahmed Suja. I'm the founder of Ecos Incorporated. I'd like to welcome you to our tutorial video on the Ecos process. A chemical separation is enabled by a spiral wound membrane. A feed solution is fed into the membrane that's a hemp or cannabis oil that is diluted 10 to 1 to 100 to 1 ratio between solvent and oil. The solution is fed into the membrane and what is allowed to pass is called the permeate stream and that is set by the level of molecular cutoff of the membrane. A stream that is rejected is called the retentate stream and these are the compounds that do not make it through the membrane. This is the idea of a cross flow membrane. Continuing looking at the molecular scale, the winterization step is occurring at room temperature by having the drug molecule, say the blue representing THC, go through the membrane, whereas the long chain waxes are not allowed to go through the membrane, and these are the larger molecules at the top. Continuing on to desolvation, what occurs? The solvent molecules are allowed to pass through the membrane, whereas in this case, both the drug molecule and longer molecules are not allowed to pass. So essentially you're desolvating the solution at room temperature. Looking at the construction of this module, the way it works, <clears throat> we have a telescoping device that spirals these polymer sheets around and the permeate flows through the center hollow tube where the retentate slides along the surface of the membrane. Looking further at the structure of the membrane, you have a feed spacer that keeps the membrane from fouling as the, as the solution is flowing along the surface. What makes it through the membrane has to penetrate through the membrane layer and then in between this layer here is where the permeate flows. This layered structure allows you to spiral wound the membrane to make a continuous flow system. Continuing on, the feed is actually going through uh, along the edge and then the permeate, what makes it through, flows directly through. This is the conclusion of the video and hopefully this helps you understand how our ECOS process works. Thank you. Goodbye.